I'd like to talk to you about tarantula anatomy, or the parts of a tarantula's body. And to help me with this, I have my friend Wesley. The Athanapelma chalcotes, or desert blonde or Arizona blonde tarantula. So, Wesley, as you can see, has eight legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But he also has these two little arm-like appendages in front of his front legs, between that and his mouth. And they are called pedipalps. And they are used for the spider to help manipulate and hold their food, as well as in mating in the males. In addition to the pedipalps and the eight legs, in between the two pedipalps, I don't know if you can see down here, are the chelicerae which are the mouthpieces that hold the fangs. And right now, Wesley's fangs are tucked underneath him, which is good. Tarantulas also have two body parts, this one and this one. Now, you may know that insects have three body parts, a head, a thorax, and an abdomen. In the spiders, the head and the thorax are combined into what's called a cephalothorax. And this is the part of the body where all the legs come out of, in addition to the pedipalps and the mouth. And you can see, I hope, this little cluster right here at the front of the spider's cephalothorax that are the spider's eyes. Tarantulas do not have very good eyesight. They depend on a sense of touch more than anything else. And so all the hairs that cover a tarantula's body are used to help sense the environment. They can sense wind blowing. They can sense motion. They're very sensitive. Now, if we turn Wesley around, if you see this dark part right here, those are what's called spinnerets. And they are where the silk comes out that Wesley spins as a tarantula. Tarantulas do not make webs, but they do use silk for a lot of things. And if you look here in Wesley's enclosure, you can see that he has covered much of the ground with a thick layer of his silk. So I can only imagine that that makes things more comfortable for him. Plus he also uses silk in mating. So there you have it, the body, the legs, the mouth, and the eyes, and the pedipalps, and the spinnerets of a tarantula. Discover more at ambler.temple.edu forward slash science of scary.